Hello friends, today we'll learn about condensation and its forms, dew, fog, frost, and mist. Wow, you're prepared to study about this. Let's start. Matter exists in three states, solid, liquid, and gas. If we cool a gas, it becomes a liquid. This process is known as condensation. It is the process by which a gas changes into a liquid due to a reduction in the energy of its particles. Condensation happens when the vapors in the air become cold. When the vapor gets cold, it transforms back into a liquid form. Dew, fog, frost, and mist are the forms of condensation. Let's learn about them one by one. Dew. At dawn, very small drops of water often cling to grass and plants. This moisture is known as dew. Air contains water in the form of gas, which is called water vapor. When warm, moist air passes over cool surfaces, the air gets cool. The water vapor in the air starts to condensate and changes into small drops. It looks so lovely. The drops cling to cool surfaces such as leaves and flower petals. The temperature at which condensation begins to happen is called the dew point. Fog. Tiny water drops hovering in the air are known as fog. Fog looks like a cloud, but it is near the ground, not up in the sky. It becomes difficult to see when the fog is thick. Fog forms from water vapor, which is actually water in the form of gas. When the air cools, water vapor in the air condenses or turns back into liquid. Fog appears when this liquid accumulates of dust in the air. A moderate wind helps fog to form and to stay in the air. Fog is very common in valleys and nearby water bodies. Frost it is water vapor, or water in gas form, that becomes solid. Frost generally forms on objects like windows and plants that are outside in air which is saturated or filled with good amount of moisture. Usually, frost forms at night when the air temperature is cooler. Mist Mist is very small droplets of water hanging in the air. These tiny droplets form when hot water in the air is rapidly cooled, causing it to convert from invisible gas to tiny visible droplets of water. Mist is more common in forest regions and mountain regions. Fog and mist differ by how far we can see through them. Fog is when you can easily see less than one kilometer away, and if you can view further than one kilometer, it is mist. Also, fog is denser than mist. Now, you know a lot about condensation and its various forms. Stay tuned for more videos. Bye-bye.